My perfume is confidence. They smell it when I walk in. My swagger is indifference. I don't care what she said or what she did. I'm sure about me, so they look at me fascinated. I'm only five feet one, so I have to stand tall. My head is high. My walk is finessed. I look at no one. I go straight ahead. It must be the renewed innocence. It must be my background or how I step. They tell me lies and stories trying to ravish my head. In my head, I think of him and only him. But even he tries to fool me, so I look straight ahead. The men are looking for a victim, but I cannot stay dead. Now it seems I've been arrested. I'm being accused of two crimes. I'm not sure I committed. Do you have anything to say for yourself? You will do time. So my story begins. There was a time I was soft-spoken, words in my mind but never in the open. My head was always down, my moments stolen. But life took me by surprise and then I was golden. We pity women with their heads hung low. We say stand up. Me, I got right up though. Cause the irony is we tell people to have confidence. But we grimace when they display too much sureness of themselves. We can't stand when someone else really stands. Objection! Overruled! The judge says. Crime 2! Oh yes, there's two of them. I've tried to give, but I hold back on the receiver. I've caught them by their actions and words. Some men are born deceivers. But I never show it. I keep going. Even women tell me I should sacrifice, that I need to hear the lies. No man is really free, so I say I'd rather keep cats than smile. So because I'm confident and unbothered, they sentence me to jail. For life! They want to put cuffs on me, telling me to stay in. They want to check up on me, how I'm doing, asking what I did. And no, this is not me imagining. It's funny the severity of reassurance in how you live. I guess the judges are the ones who disagree with freedom of expression of oneself. I guess the plaintiffs are the ones telling me to give in. I guess my crime really is that I'm freed from ever being bound by anyone, foe nor friend. I walk on out, freed from any confinement. Thank you.